Hey, welcome back. Well, after you make your first login in your AIX unit, you are going to see a screen like this one, except for this course by Jeff Borges, which is a customization that I did for my instance here. Uh, one of the most important things that we are going to do, the first thing that we're going to do is to determine which shell this AIX is using. Because when the AIX instance was created in the, in the cloud, it created with a specific shell, and we are going to find out which shell was that. So with this command, echo dollar sign zero, we will know this instance is using the corn shell. This KSH is telling us that the instance is using the corn shell. And one thing that we are going to do is to change this corn shell to the best shell. The best shell is, let's say, for beginners, it's a much better way to learn uh, the initial commands. So this is the reason we are going to change to the bash. And to do that, we are going to use this change shell command. The change shell command shows us all the shells that are available in this specific unit. We have all those shells here. The one that we are going to use is the bash shell, is this one here. So it asks us change, yes or no, and we're going to say yes. What to, what shell are you going to use? We're going to use this bin slash bash shell. Okay, so now that we use this command, let's check if it is changed. Let's go and do the echo zero again. And oops, no, it did not change. That's because we need to do a restart in our unit. So uh, we will log in to the bash shell. So let's give an exit. Our, oops, exit. All right, then you open your PuTTY again. It's going to load it. There is some customization that I need to do first. Uh, let me just show it here. Let's change our background to this color here. And, oh, I mean, our foreground. And our background, let's change from this color to this one. Okay, then I'm going to save this session so I can keep the the colors that that, are, and then I'm going to open. So you log in again. Use that long password that you use it to create the the unit and there we go you can see that the prompt is telling us that we are using the bash already so you can see this bash 5.1 saying that okay now we're using bash so let's confirm that by using the equal dollar zero and that's it we are using the bash shell. so this is the first thing that we must do and now we can let's to our first command here, which is uh, the df command minus g. And this is showing us the file systems that we have available in this particular unit. If you are used to a Linux machine, you probably would use a command like df minus h, where h is for human readable, but it did not work in AIX. So in AIX, there are many different commands that uh, when you try to use some uh, Linux commands here, they will not work. This is why it's important that you learn AIX in a different way from uh, Linux. If you already know Linux, but you still need to study AIX because they, they are different, believe me. So that's it for now. If you can do that, change your bash. And then you exit and you log in again. And let's go to our next lesson.